You look so beautiful. Thank you. Oh, you look lovely. Yeah, thank you. You look amazing. Thank you. So beautiful. And you're very smooth. Thank you. You smell good. That's my goal for the day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Don't see her, but she's there. Dead leaves are moving. I was nervous to write my vows, and I honestly started thinking about promises that I haven't kept. But I also thought about all the promises that I could. Um, I thought about the fact I can't promise that I'll always do the dishes, but that our home will always be open to the people we love. I can't promise that I'll always be able to get you a window seat, but I promise that I'll always be by your side. I'll love you like Sunday morning slow, with a heavy sense of comfort and knowing if we did nothing else, that might just be perfect. And I will love you like your childhood stuffed animal Walter, like I was brought into your life with no other purpose but to love you. To say that I'm excited for our life together doesn't do justice to how I feel. And I couldn't describe it if I tried, but here today, I'm the luckiest person in the world. As you know, something that's really important to me is when people show up. In spite of distance and schedules and med school and chaos, you've been showing up for me since 2016. Even when I didn't think you could possibly have time and even when you actually did not have time, <laughs> without fail, you showed up. You've taught me that I'm not alone, that I am safe, and that I'm worth showing up for. So today, my promise to you is that I will show up. No matter how tired I am or how busy we get, I promise to show up for you, even when you don't want me to. <laughs> <laughs>
because you deserve all the love you so freely give others and so much more. I love you impossibly. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now seal your vows with a kiss. Dear love, thank you for bringing Josh and Taylor together to Michigan. Thank you for bringing into their lives all of the amazing family gathered here to recognize and share all the love that exists between and among and for each one of us forever and ever. Amen. Still Josh and Taylor, and we will continue to surround you and to show up for you. We're so happy for you both and for Lila. Thank you for gathering all of us in this place to share this moment with you. We love you. So I get back to his house he showed me around and he shows me down. They, they bring me inside to this basement room. And they said, set down your stuff and they go back upstairs. And they close the door and I started to cry because I didn't know how much I needed my brother and how much I loved the life that you two had created for one another. And I didn't know I needed that care at that time. But it was so evident to me, the love that you have for one another, how gracious you are with it, how much you're willing to share it with other people. It's just the greatest gift you could ever give. She quickly became Josh's MVP in life. They've gone through challenges together as a couple with such resiliency that I know that they'll be great teammates for the rest of their lives. Josh, I could not ask for a better partner for my best friend. And Tay, I couldn't have parted with you to anyone less worthy. Uh, I love you both so much, and I'm so, so happy for you.